Hey guys, it's Postbox Pat. Now today guys, this is going to be a different video. I didn't expect to make something like this, but it's pretty serious because if you guys watch YouTube every single day, it's your main source of kind of entertainment. Also, maybe if you watch other things on other networks like Facebook, Reddit, places like that, Snapchat, this is something major guys. Article 13, it's basically going to kill the internet in my opinion. What exactly is this? It's basically an article that is going to restrict us because of copyright rules and regulations that's going to allow us not to upload any content that is already owned by someone else. So it's basically extremely strict and what it's going to actually do, it's going to cause YouTube to have to basically pull YouTube in the European Union and that is just going to be crazy. It's basically only going to allow people to upload to YouTube who are mainly big corporates, who they can trust and most people like myself and any other European creator is probably not going to be able to upload. Now what does that mean for people outside of the EU? Well basically anyone based in the US or Australia or anywhere like that outside of the EU you will not be able to watch anyone who's creating content in the EU because we won't be able to upload content. Now if you're in the EU I'm pretty sure you'll be restricted to watching EU content only which is going to be uploaded by big corporates and it won't be uploaded by the individual creator. This means it's going to affect me and many any other creators around the world. I've got three links down below. The first one is the petition, which I recommend going over there, signing that petition to save your internet. Really guys, we really need to help and try and work together as a team to support this one because it's absolutely insane what is going on in the kind of parliament section of EU. Personally, I am not someone that's into politics or anything like that. I'd hardly follow it. I just see the things there and then on the news and stuff like that. But this is something that's really serious for the digital era and really does need a lot of thought going into it i understand that many of you out there may not even have heard of article 13 or understand it 100 so the second link i've got for you guys down there will talk exactly what article 13 is it'll go over all the details youtube have made a video on it it's a very interesting video i recommend checking that out once this video is over and then the third link if you want to come back to this video is actually a link to a website which will show you guys how to contact your local mps now on screen right now we have the red people who have voted for article 13 who want to restrict the internet and the green people who attempted to save us so you can see them on screen right now pretty interesting and it really does frustrate me now exactly how can i make this as simple as possible for you guys well it's pretty obvious if you guys have seen the new avengers film you know when danos clicks his fingers and 50 percent of the population gets wiped out that's basically what this is what's happening is they are clicking their fingers in parliament wiping us out and they're going to wipe 50% of the internet out near enough in Europe because of the copyright restrictions. Now there are parts of the article which are understandable but it definitely needs to be less on the strictness. It's ridiculous how strict the article is. We can even see this here from Reddit on screen right now. They actually go to say we would repeatedly warned about how an overboard EU copyright directive could restrict Europeans equal access to the open web. We are blocking Reddit in the EU from 9 o'clock till 5 o'clock and it's just saying that and that's basically how potentially Reddit could work in the future. We are blocking Reddit in the EU today and that's basically how things could happen and you know I don't want this to happen and neither do you guys. You don't want to be going on to YouTube in the EU if you're in the UK or somewhere else in the EU typing in for example how do I do this on Fortnite? and nothing comes up everything's restricted other than trailers and you're there uh hold on a minute how do i do this or cool gameplay on fortnite or i don't know whatever you're typing in whatever you are looking for maybe some tips and tricks some advice some storyline videos map changes it won't be there guys there will be no content at all unless you're based outside of the eu but your eu creators won't be bringing that content to you guys so it's just I don't even know what to say about it. It's one of them things that I had to cover on my channel because it's really serious. I don't want to get too angry about it, but the people in Parliament generally don't really know what they're doing. They're kind of pretty old, should I say, compared to the younger generation. And they're not really 
brought up with the internet the way it is today. Most people nowadays who are my age or less will understand so much more than the older generation about the internet because they are born with it. They get to use it every single day. They understand it more than the parents, the majority of people. A lot of people nowadays use the internet 24 seven in the younger age range. Obviously the older range don't use it so much. The sort of things that older people may use the internet for, or for example, if they've got a remote control for their TV, the only thing they might use YouTube for is how do I use this remote? Simple things like that. And they're not digging deep enough for the YouTube community here. There's a lot of other things as well. Article 13 is gonna affect social media wise, but obviously I'm sticking up for the YouTube side because that's the side I personally cover on mainly. I don't really use the other platforms that much. I do have them, but I don't use them as much as YouTube. And I just think it's crazy. Now, there may be a few haters in this video who want to support Article 13. And if that is the case, I have no idea what to say to you guys because you're just going to have no content in the European Union and you won't be able to watch any European un like Union kind of YouTubers. Now, some people are probably asking me, Pat, what about Brexit? That's a big thing that's going on currently if you're based in the UK about leaving the European Union. Now, I haven't really followed that either. But from what I know, our deal is so bad that we could just be following the European laws anyway and Article 13 would still take place in the UK. That's what I know about Brexit. I think near enough everybody in the EU agrees with me on that. And the deal that we've struck with the European Union is just so bad that we just can't do anything. It's like basically playing as a default online 24-7. And these people are defaults on the internet. That's what they are. These people voting don't really know what they're doing because they just don't use the YouTube platform. They don't use these things. They don't know how much damage this could do and what it could lead to the future. There are so many things that could happen from this, which could be bad, and they're just not thinking about it. Restricting the internet this much could create so many black markets and so much other stuff as well. It is just absolutely insane. So guys, if you haven't already, go and sign the petition down below. I don't usually make videos like this, but this is everything that I've covered and know about the Article 13. It's just insane. I will link down the free links down below, which I recommend checking out all of them. 100% recommend signing the petition many other youtubers have been tweeting about this but not many have made videos on it there's a few there and then but no one's made a full video on it just yet so i hope you guys have somehow enjoyed today's video i've no idea how you've enjoyed it because it's just terrible news but somehow hit that like button to show the support to save your internet. We really do need to try our best, guys. The fight's not over. We can win this. We just need to put so much effort into it. And so many people need to sign that thing. If you guys haven't already shared this around, please tell all your friends in school, college, work, wherever you are, please tell every single person you can about Article 13. It's a very serious thing. And the links down below will give you guys a lot more information if you want to contact your MPs about it, to have like maybe a phone call with them or something like that. There's also a link down below to show you guys exactly what Article 13 is. It'll go over everything in that video. And there is also on the page where you can contact your MPs, it'll go over loads on there. And the petition as well, I 100% recommend it signing that. It's a really serious thing, guys. Please go out of your way to sign that. So I hope you guys have somehow got some information from this video that is kind of informative. I hope you guys are aware of it. If you haven't heard of it before, let me know down in the comment section. And also, let me know what you actually think of Article 13. Do you think it's actually a good idea? Because you must be crazy if you do. But let me know. But anyway, that's it for this video, guys. Uh, stick around on my channel. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell if you haven't already, if you're into Fortnite content. If not, I hope you have enjoyed today's video on Article 13. I hope to see as many of you guys in the future. Once again, this is Postbox Pat, signing out.